Jones on Lee Sin Jingle Jangle. We've gone for standard stuff here, except the Ghost Poro, which we've forgotten to take again. Poor old Ghost Poro sitting in the in the ethereal realm without a friend, because we keep forgetting to take him with us. But pretty standard stuff here. We get some damage. Ingenious Hunter reduces our trinket cooldown, which is great for uh, being able to actually ward with our trinket as well as using it to to ward hop. And secondary tree, we've got the Cosmic Insight and free boots, so I can focus on getting all my gold into uh, into my warrior enchant. And then if I need to as well, and I want to like rush, like a Yumuz or something like that, then I can do that too, and really like rush those items. Oh, he just used his Q. I mean, that's not really worth it, is it? Really, bro? Please don't take the skill. God bless. Did he genuinely just do that? I mean, he did, but... Ah! I shouldn't listen to this. I'm getting so stuck on this, Caitlyn. Holy fuck. Why do I listen to these calls? Why did I listen? Lame. I should have just like the thing is though, like, okay, so terrible call. Awful, awful decision. Don't know why we did that, but why did I do it? Agree. Why did I, why did I do it? Because he's, someone told me to do it and I was like, sure. Like if you if you make a call, I'll follow it. That's not smart, it's really dumb. And now if Rengar has my topside jungle, I'm in a bit of a sad spot. Fortunately he's just gone top side instead. But he has 20 CS now, I have 8. So, yeah, really, really suboptimal for him to... He gave me that kill. That was my, like, that was my lead. And failure to really pressure him from that. But let's see if we can get Cassiope here. She's pushing pretty hard. Don't know if this is warded. I don't think it is, actually. Nice, you got it. Good job. It's a really bad habit of mine. I just follow people's calls like blindly. It's like it doesn't matter what the call is. If someone makes a call, I'll just be like, yeah, sure, let's do it. It's a terrible, like even if it's terrible cause, you know, because ultimately it's my fault, right? Like, I mean, I can I can rage at my team as much as I like, but I'm the one who did it. You know, I still went through with it. Hey folks, do you miss Green Smite? Uh, not really. I mean, at least in sort of, but overall not really. Hey Josh, what's up? Hi Tabitha. Nice. He actually could have killed me there. Oh shit, send this because I hate having an odd number of stars. <laughs> sure. <laughs> Thank you, Ellie. Which is grass, yes. <laughs> I know exactly how you feel. So sometimes you send me like 173 stars. Is that like you put in $2 or something? Wait, or like... Wait, no, how does that work? Do you just get the... Because like twice you set in the same kind of random number. It's okay, we're fine. Alright, so I should be getting my boots in like two and a half minutes. Oh, two minutes, never mind. Three minutes. Let's try to punish this flashless Cassiopeia. I would like level five though, so let's take a camp first. If we get Fizz out of the lane phase, then we should be in a decent...
Ah. Holy fuck, my life. Ah, that's really bad. Look at this. Like, hello? Can someone come and help? <laughs> Please! Help me! Why is Braum here first? Are you kidding me? Actually being hard trolled right now by my team. Wait, what is she doing? <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> that is... That is something. I don't know. Like... I understand, if someone's on the tower, it's kind of hard to leave the lane, but come on, like, this guy is just, I don't know, he's, like, tilted, or, I, I don't know, like, he's, he's just not using his brain, like, just please come and punish him, please, I beg of you, and, like, to get invaded by the enemy bot lane when they, they had to leave and then run all the way up and around, when we literally could have just gone like this, I just, I just, I, lost for words, genuinely lost for words. It's... Poor, poor show. This could be good. Scripter. I've gone way too early here, holy fuck. Have I? I swear that <laughs> that was a butt clencher right there. That was a butt clencher. I I mean I understand it right, like it looks like she's just dead, so you don't want to use your ult. But yeah, that would have been really awkward if we lost the kill because of that. Issue with my bot side losing like this is, yeah, is, is Dragon, so... Uh... Be careful. Yes. Where am I needed? That's fine. I mean, she has ult now, right? So she can kill me. I need my ult in five seconds. Don't know why I flashed that, but... Thing is, she had her phase rush and her Q up, right? So she goes, like, super speedy. Yeah, 
Okay, that's fine. And because I was also over the Miasma, I couldn't use my Warthog. Mountain? Okay. Take that. Actually, it's kind of good for us. <laughs> Just kill the Braum, kick the Kaiser out. She's speedy. The reason why I wanted to hop over this wall, this is going to sound really lame, right? And this is like a really kind of, uh, isn't Caitlyn? Okay. This is like a really lame excuse, but this, so it's going to go the same distance, right? And it's like, if I have a ward over this wall, then there's a chance that I'll actually get value out of this ward in case Rengar invades me. It's a, it's, I don't know why my brain operated in this way, because it's like the most technical thing that is probably not going to influence anything. You know, like, uh, there's probably like a thousand scenarios or a thousand things this Rengar can do and only one of them would make this ward valuable. But my brain's just like, yeah, let's do that instead. Yeah, I don't know. Brain machine broke. Stop critting me, bitch. 15 seconds till my ulti. Braum can die. But I don't want to die myself. I have a 600 bounty. They dive me. Holy fuck! Those crits. I'm actually triggered. I'm actually triggered. I was gonna insta kill her. Holy shit! She has a 20% crit chance. 25% crit chance, and she did that to me. Fuck! That is unlucky. Big trigger. Cool thing about these magical boots as well is it's like your the necessity to have tier two boots is kind of low or lower because you have plus ten move speed on these boots anyway. So, whereas tier one boots is normally twenty five and tier two is forty five, uh, these boots make me have thirty five. So it bridges the gap very nicely. I'm actually oh man that is still it's really irritating me. <laughs> Like, that's the AD carry gets fucking 600 gold shot down because she crits me like that. That feels a little bit. Okay. Great thing about Ingenious Hunter as well is it works with my Yumus. So now this thing's up quite a lot, so I can run around like Sanic. Yo, I had to thread that needle pretty fine. Good distraction, bro. Good distraction. What's up, Amit? I <sighs> know, so close. My electric cute got that second kill. Yeah, we can do this. Yeah. 
Man, I really want level 11 though. We can do this. Actually, guys, I want to show you my favorite build, okay? I love this build so much. It's really ballsy, but I love it. You get this early Yumus, and then you go for the Guardian Angel. So you have loads of damage, but you can't actually just instantly die. So it kind of gets rid of some of the... Whoa, that was a misclick. It gets rid of some of the risk involved. Alright, level 11. Perfect stuff. Now we have rank 2 ulti. Considering we have a high damage build, rank 2 ulti is pretty important for us. Why would you ult her though? 112 gold, literally worse than a scuttle crab. Barely worth the control ward I invested into getting getting that kill. Legitimately. This is an int. <laughs> That's not a good idea, Foxy. <laughs> That's no bueno. Wow, what a dodge. If I'd put the Herald down before I did that, this would have been good. I mean, it's it's still good, right? We still we still got you know net positive and stuff. I just need to be way more careful if I'm playing full AD. So why that's why I go for this gu this Guardian Angel build, right? Because then I do that, and I just don't die. If I had the stopwatch or something, I wouldn't die there. And An inhibitor. Your team has destroyed an inhibitor. Pick up some farm here. Don't want to fall behind in levels. I mean, I'm not going to fall behind in levels, but I want to keep the pace up in my levels. Cast is like literally not worth my time here, so. Not going to go for a. I do have my Herald still. But I'd like to get down. Oh, you're in trouble now, buddy. Perfect stuff. A bellissimo. Crazy pressure in both lanes now. We have Herald plus Baron with the split push. This is going to be very hard for these guys to defend. Ah, shit. Let's just go ahead and shield some of our team here so we uh, pad our KDAs with assist points. There it is. Do we get the Shelly dance? Oh, Nautilus, baby. Let's go. <laughs> we get Shelly. <laughs> Good shit. I was a little bit... No, that was fine. That was a good game. 
Vic just smashed me, yo. Oh, three. Can we get four? Oh, four. Let's go. My whole team appreciates me. Every single one of them. Beautiful stuff. Easy peasy. Lemon squeezy.